In this lesson, I'll guide you through the process of downloading OpenOffice, a program that includes OpenOffice Writer, to a Mac computer. If you need to install OpenOffice Writer on a PC, please check the companion lesson for PC users. First, open your browser and go to the OpenOffice website. You can do so either by Googling OpenOffice or by entering the following URL into your browser. Toward the top of the screen, you'll see a list of options. Click on Download. Focus on the green window near the top of the new screen. You'll see that there are three menus. One for your operating system, one for your preferred language, and one for the software version. Leave the language set to English and the version set to the most current version, in this case 4.1.1. Click on the arrow next to the Operating System menu and you'll see that you have two different options for Macs, OS X 64-bit and OS X 32-bit. To find out which one you should use, click on the Apple icon in the top left corner of your screen. Choose About This Mac from the drop-down menu and look to see what kind of processor you have. If you have an Intel Core Solo or an Intel Core Duo, you should choose the option for 32-bit. If you have any other kind of Intel processor, including Intel Core 2 Duo, you should choose the option for 64-bit. Click Download Full Installation. You'll see the status of the download in the bottom left corner of your browser window. Depending on your internet connection, the download may take some time. When it's finished, the download status will be replaced with one line, Apache OpenOffice DMG. Click on it. A status bar will appear as the software opens. Wait until you see a box with a gray bar containing the OpenOffice logo and a folder icon. Click and hold on the OpenOffice logo in the gray bar and drag it to the folder icon. Release. You'll see another status bar as the software installs. When the status bar disappears, Click on your Finder icon and choose Applications from the sidebar. Scroll until you find the OpenOffice logo and double-click on it. You may get a warning bar asking you if you want to open something downloaded from the Internet. Click the Open button. Close the Finder box and you are in OpenOffice. Double-click on the Text Document option and a blank OpenOffice Writer document will appear. And that's it! You now have OpenOffice Writer installed on your computer. In the next lesson, I'll give you an orientation to the software and show you where some of the buttons and menus you'll use most often are. Thanks for joining me for this tutorial.